Welcome to Shoreline Park for the playing of the annual uh, Grizzly Martin Hogan Challenge. Uh, as Grizzly would put it, a good ploughing day here, a bit brisk, slight breeze coming down from Dara Hills onto the lake. And we have a, a French referee for this, uh, especially phone over from, sure, Paris, sure. from Paris this morning. Yes. Um, are, are you fully uh, fair with the rules? Well, I know some of them anyway. Yes. And will you be very harsh now on, on, on fellas' fainting injury and all that sort of I thing? I will be cruel. I will have no mercy on nobody. Right. I believe you have a dental practice and 50% uh, uh, reduction this evening on, on any fillings or, or crowns that need to be done because there'll be a bit of rivalry here, you know. Well, we're hoping for a few broken front teeth <laughs> and yes, we'll consider a 50% discount. Yes. Ah, that's yes, very yes. good. And, and my information is to be still dear at that anyway. <laughs> <laughs> I have here with me now the managers of both teams for today's game, uh, John Sheedy, looking fairly portly, I have to say, and uh, surprised to see you in a jacket today, this mild day, uh, touch you in the short sleeves, Sean Statley, well Sean, how's your team, are they fit and able to go? Oh, they're ready to go, yeah, hopping off the ground. I heard the referee's going to be very strict on feigning injury, so have you informed them of that or...? Well... There's no need to because they're well disciplined. Okay, well disciplined. Right. And I hope they have to come in for a good game and they're able to produce something against us. All right, okay. And you're confident in winning the, oh, the okay. Martin Grizzly Hogan and, and Perpetual Trophy? Definitely, yeah. Oh, very good. And you always wear, I have to say. Yeah. Now, Shady, you're up against it. You're up against it. I don't know what rule. I don't know what rules are going to be played here today, whether it's Australian rules or Darla rules or what sort of rules are going to be played, but uh, you're looking forward to the game. Very much so, Sean, yeah. Delighted to be here. Uh, and also, the only thing about my team, we're all very grey, <laughs> which isn't, I suppose, a great sign, but sure, what can we do? Yeah. Uh, uh, it's great to be here, sure, and we're remembering the great man Martin Hogan who played soccer and hurling and football and everything for the parish, and sure, we'll have a good old day anyway, whatever about anything else. Without a doubt. You mentioned that some of your team were grey, a lot of them look grey in the face today as well. <laughs> I don't know what that'll be from, probably the bank holiday weekend. That's yeah, it. probably has something to do with it, all right, yes, Johnny. Yeah, partic but sure. Particularly a uh, Mayo man out there, I don't think he's going to last even the first half now alone the second half. Uh, he's very confident. Is he's he? Yeah, very okay. confident, yeah, yeah, very confident. Of course, the county is steeped in soccer tradition. Very much so. Oh, without a doubt, without a doubt. So I'll shake hands with Shane. Oh, of course, yes. Of course, yes. <laughs> and uh, and no, made the best team win. No, foul about no, <laughs> no, 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 no incursions onto the sideline now by either manager, okay? Have a nice day. Okay. Now the game is on here at the moment. Uh, our Rovers are in their traditional red and white and the J team are in the traditional green and gold. And uh, we have a motley crew for the J crew today. We have... Uh, Ger Power, Justin Conroy, Just John Sheedy, Anthony Freeman, Robert Freeman, Jim Leahy. Jim Leahy is not wearing his headgear. His head is open to the elements. David Creamer, Dennis Quinn, uh, PJ O'Donnell, and Patrick Power. And uh, our, our Rovers team are Donald Fogarty, Stephen Flynn, Matthew Kendi. Flown home specially from the Lebanon. He's the one with the, the Royal Ten, as the man says, on the legs. Uh, Kevin Meher, Nigel Flood, Aaron Gleason. Um, Sean Nightingale and Gerald Kirby. So the game is on at the moment. Uh, are playing, as we call it, down the field, uh, towards the lake from the Arrow Hills. A slight breeze in their favour uh, for uh, the GA club. Leahy is on the ball now at the moment. I think the GA club are playing a 4 4 2 formation. They are indeed, yes, that's right. And the uh, ball has gone out now to the left here. Gerald Power is not as fit as he used to be, but he, he couldn't be anyway. He's living in Clare for a long time. Was a free? It should have been a yellow card there for Gerald Power, but ball has gone in now. Number nine for Ara. Denny Quinn sweeps it out. Oh, that's a lovely central ball now. Oh, save. The brilliant save. But Paddy Moroni, is it? Paddy Moroni, yes. Paddy Moroni is going to two-fold mission here today. He's taking plans for a new field. And our fight is in goals. Jim is down, he's up again. Arrow still on the attack here now. I must say, Lahey looks very flat footed, I, and PJ O'Donnell, I'd say, bought him at a hard weekend. Oh, there's a break on. There's a break on here now, Dahi Leeson. Yes. John Sheedy, John Sheedy, oh, he's making headway. He's making headway. I'm afraid, no, I'm afraid not. 
Now, lads, if we could get the crowd back to the line here now because they could be cautious onto the field. Yes, Sheedy's on the ball now. He's going in along the byline. A great centre, nobody there to collect. Oh, my goodness. <coughs> Matty Kindy out now again. Matty looks very fit after his sojourn in the Lebanon. Enjoyed his Christmas dinner before he went in the month of November. Jar power now for the GA club. On to Justin. Justin is after smoking about 20 facts before the off. Oh, that's a... Oh, what, what a brilliant, what a brilliant try. By Robert Freeman. Hit the post. Goal in over. <coughs> that was a brilliant try. Brilliant first effort by Robert Freeman. PJ O'Donnell is struggling already with fitness. Wouldn't be wouldn't be a runner in the stairs hurdle, hurdle at Cheltenham, I'd say, by the looks of PJ at the moment. Ball out into the centre of the field again now. Out on the attack, Jared Power. Good clearance out to Justin. Justin into Nanny now. Nanny goes off with nobody there. Lacking a bit of pace up front. Come on, Nanny, something's never changed. I have with me here now on the sideline, Liam Sheedy. Uh, well, flew down specially from Dublin Airport now <laughs> to Shannon at around 11 o'clock to be with us today after his sojourn with Michael yesterday. Well, good occasion here today, Liam. Oh, then he's in. Sean, we have a goal coming up, I think. Yes, the high Oh, oh for the second bearing. time in the game. For the second time in the game. <laughs> Denied by the crossbar. Well, Liam, you're enjoying this, I'd say. Enjoy, good, good, good fear, Sean, good fear. There's a foul throw by John Sheedy. Not know about that. Oh, well. without a doubt, yeah. Christ, he's on the ball now. The toe poke is going to come into play, I'd say, here, Sean. Yes, here he comes. Oh, well cleared, well cleared. Lahi is on the ball now. Tinny Quinn is there. We have a few Christy Browns, I think, oh, Sean. Oh, we have, I think, indeed, yes. But it's great to remember the great Grizzly in a kind of a goodwill gesture like this, isn't it? And, absolutely, you know, absolutely. With all his former friends and colleagues. He was Enjoy, a legend. Enjoying the game, and isn't that what it was all about at the time? He was a legend. He was indeed. Okay. He'd be in his element here now in the big long boots. He certainly would, and no doubt he'd be at the <laughs> hockey match yesterday in between <laughs> Ireland and South <laughs> Korea. Not a doubt in the world, but he would have been. Okay. Right, Liam, we'll leave you here for a while. <laughs> Troy now on the lower side of the field. Gone out again. Into the into the tall rough as we'll say. Quite a big gathering here now today in Shoreditch Park. Many a great game here now as well over the years. Lahi gets the ball in now. Dahi Kramer is there. Anthony Freeman. Dahi. Decent. Centre to Sheedy, but he's not there, missing that. that yeah, another great try. Oh, great save by the goalie. A great save by Donald Fogley. Absolutely brilliant. Out again now. I think our are playing a 5 5 2 formation at the moment. Well, Matt, how are you? Oh, not so bad. Playing one up front. Now Robert comes on the ball. Judicious back heel there by the Irish centre half. Ball comes out here to the line now. <laughs> Dye has the ball now again. 32 on his back. We are throwing out to the G8 club. Robert gets the ball. Ran into, ran into the goal area. Out again. Leahy done well to get that one. Delicate touch by Robert. Back to Dahi. Dahi to the other Dahi. But the goalie comes to the rescue again. Oh, this goalie's playing a magnificent game. Dolan Fogarty. A magnificent game he's playing here for Ireland.
Perlis is the ball now up to Nigel. Nigel Flood from Tony Bryan. Oh, interferes. He's going through, straight through. Out comes Moroni. You'd swear he was at it all his life. A brilliant clearance. Justin from Faha. So there's a great tweed. Denny Quinn. Another man after 20 fights before the off today. Nightingale. Up along to Nigel. Out over the line again. Hello, Pat. How are you? <laughs> Nanny again. Yes, Nanny. Well turned. Has to get the ball in a little bit earlier, though. This French referee hasn't blown the whistle yet. I think he's walking an air around the place. The hydration is all over the field. Oh, there comes now to Nanny. Now oh, Stephen. Anthony again, sweeper. Back to Robert, his brother Robert. Robert plays it well now. Oh my goodness! I thought P.J. O'Donnell's head was going to fall off at that occasion. His body went one way and the head went the other. An attack now by Aaron. This looks dangerous. Sean Knightley again. Oh yes, a bit of save by Maroney again. <coughs> Crowder getting irate here with the French referee. Big crowd assembled here now on the sideline. Some of them very happy after their weekend, I'd say. Denny Quinn. I must say, the J Club, for all their, 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 their superiority, just can't get the ball into the net. Aaron making the odd furry up the field against the breeze, but which pass coming this time? Robert gets it. Out by Maher. Nanny in around the house again, but this goalie is magnificent. I hope the, the scouts here from some of the, the championship or premiership clubs here today. They'll certainly be looking at this arrow goalie. Ferris side back. Oh! Bit of a shamazzle there in the middle of the field. Ferris and Nanny. <coughs> Denny Quinn. It's a John Sheedy. A deft touch by John. Kind of a Gary Owen. Or a Bortillion, or whatever you call it. Corner here. No, the goalie is out again. I say this goalie doesn't drink at all. He's fierce fit looking. Nigel Flood, good man. Dahi stops him in his tracks. Nigel goes back again for more. Good man, Nigel. Up to Nightingale. Nightingale, a deft touch in. But who's there? Only Lahi. Yes, indeed. Nice turns by Lahey. Out by Jared Power. The half it there, man. Paul Ferris now. The money man. Oh! That's a very bad tackle. I must say the referee wasn't watching that. This referee, I think, is a rugby match. He, I think, is a rugby match. He, he, he's refereeing, or he thinks he's refereeing. Nice to take off side there. Oh, yellow card has to come out here. Yellow card. Yellow card. Yes. <coughs> I say there'll be only another warning, and that's it. Curtains. I see Denny Ryan out there now with a few words. Denny hasn't judged yet to dismiss the pitches and no smoking area. However, we'll continue. 
<laughs> Hand barred by Ferris again. I'd say he was thought he was grabbing a twenty pound note. That's your candy out. Quinny. Quinny the ball on to Reardon. Maroney is out fast out of the goals. Wins it out over the line at the far side of the field. I said, there were a huge crowd here now today. Great to see all the kids, boys and girls, and all the ladies out in their finery after Patrick's weekend. Grizzly will be proud of them all. Oh, magnificent goal but for our Rovers, a magnificent goal. Aaron Leeson all the way, all the way from the throw-in. That was magnificent. That was magnificent. Maroney badly, Maroney badly cut out here. The local publican is tugging out, yes, the local publican is tugging out now. Yeah, but I told him to fucking only make sure they were soaked. He's not in the best of form, the local publican, but he, he, he's, he's making the effort to go on the field at the moment. <laughs> <laughs> Big round of applause now for the local publican, he goes onto the field. <clears throat> oh yes, a brilliant clearance, making his mark already. <coughs> <coughs> Alice seemed to have a great way of attacking up on that left flank. Anthony. Oh, a wonderful header by, by Dahi. We nearly consider that a foul throw by John Sheedy, but that's it to Nanny. Nobody here, I'm afraid. Oh, yes. Matty, deft touch again. Always had a great deft touch with the ball. Matty Kennedy from Lynn Crew. Now of the Lebanon. Not long home. I think he could do with taking this referee out to the United Nations for a for a spell. He's not Ah, he again clears it out. Oh, after it again. Now the local public in Pat Ryan gets it now again. Going to be cleared out by Dahi Deason. Aaron Deason now. Nice header by Aaron. Son of the late and great Jim Deason. And certainly Pat Ryan is after making a magnificent impression since he came in here. On the ball again. Quinney now has the ball. Fine soccer player this Quinney is given half a chance, he'll score. Attack breaks down again. Reared them back to Pat Ryan. Reared them to Ryan. Centre half for Lara has played a magnificent game, number 14. Played a magnificent game. Robert over his head. Anthony Freeman again now. <clears throat> Tahi. He's fitter than your thing, looks a bit lazy, but has a bit of a run in him. Attack file there now down to the other side of the field. A throw now to the G8 club. A foul throw every time. I don't, I don't know what the referee is looking at. Oh. It's a brilliant ball now, but Lehi intercepts.
Pass Ryan now. Took his eye off it. Robbed by the Mayo man. No, Nanny. Nanny is going to have a go now. Sends it over to the Faha man, Tweed. Justin. Justin's going a bit backwards here, yes. Ferris interrupts. It's a great ball now into Nightingale, yes. Does he control it? He does. Oh, there's a brilliant ball out now to Flood. Flood on in his own up here, this right flank of the field. Oh, a great centre. Moroni, is he going to be caught again? Very near it. Very near it. Jeff Tedder, ball gone wide. Ball gone wide now. <coughs> Dahi is coming over here, he's looking for water. Some of the players looking for water here, but no water, I'm afraid. Take a swig out of Dylan's Coke there if you want to. Some of the players here looking for oxygen now and a drop of water as well. That's Nigel. PJ Donald playing a stormer. Oh! As I see, Dahi is getting some water. Dahi Kramer getting some water here now. The best we can offer him at the moment. Oh my goodness, I wonder was that they get go over the line. Maybe not. We haven't the benefit of the TV replay today. Yay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> threatening here. I think there's a goal coming. No, no. Natalie Kramer is holding the Grizzly Shield here in front of me at the moment. And who have we here sitting on a ball? No one. No one. Very good. <laughs> Danny is getting water as well. This is more like an oasis now than a soccer pitch at the moment with all the players pulling up for water. I like Hamels. Yeah. Meher, oh, brilliant, brilliant. Brilliant clearance by Meher there now. Anthony is fit as a fiddle. Now we have Sheedy. Sheedy. Oh, brilliant. <laughs> Dallas is on his own here now, what'll he do? Heads it, heads it on to Nightingale, on to Quinney. And Justin looks up, that's a great ball. If you want to score in the end, it is a great ball, not here. Half time here at the moment now, is it? Oh, an answer there, so. I see. have to improve a bit in your performance so in the second you, half. You're giving me a hint. I'm certainly giving you a hint. Okay. Remember that one. Okay. And job. Stiffish breeze blowing down from the area hills now for the second half. Here we go again. Players off again now. Commencing. Anthony again. Nightingale. Number five. Big tall man, Lahey, doing his best I have to say, must find the day cold, very little touch left. Dahi, we have an injury here now up, yes we have an injury. We have an injury here now, Stephen O'Flaherty is down. Got a belt of the ball in 
I suppose what you call not a very nice place. Ah, he'll be better before next Patrick's day if it looks of it. See the rain creamer going round there now, she's all business. Looks well in a pair of Weltons, I have to say. Referee brandishes a yellow card now. And I have to say, he has the socks down around ankles, the ref has. Ball oh, comes in again now. Well cleared. Don't forward to having a great game. As a flock of Sterling's rises. Justin, oh, just a very lackadaisical deer. Absolutely very good. Christopher Reardon. Christopher Reardon. Christopher Reardon. A brilliant goal by Christopher Reardon. Magnificent. A magnificent. And I have to say, Mar Maroney, right to stay where he was. Wasting his time as he is coming off his line. We have a man stuck in the net here now. Justin, I'm afraid. His mother wouldn't be proud of that one. She'd be given out. As Nanny gets the game going again. P.J. O'Donnell. He's just like a fellow that's swimming. He, his arms are going all over, all over the place. Christopher Reardon now. Christopher intercepted by Jar Power. Sheedy again. Christopher coming into his own now, playing well. Now he goes out here. Deft touch to Robert Freeman. Jar Power feeling the pace now, I think. Getting a bit red in the face. I don't know whether his togs or his face now are redder. That was a great man in his day. Not many soccer players have get past him. Shiri to Lahi. Lahi to Dahi. Dahi. And now, Nanny. Oh, a brilliant save again. I can't say too much about this man. All in 40. Although it kills me because he's a modest man, but however. We'll have to get some of these people in off the line here now, obscuring the, the, the pictures. <laughs> penalty, penalty awarded. Although I think myself it should be maybe the other way. Should be a red card for diving. Rather than a penalty, I think. But however, <coughs> we'd often say, Shady is closer than old Fox. Nanny Power, I want to take this one. Somebody says from the line, take his point. Point one, two here. He might take it later on. This game is getting out of hand now. Oh, absolutely brilliant save. And it was a kind of a main touch out on any to hit it in again. This is a kind of a friendly game, so a very main touch out on any to hit it in the second time. I think, that, I think there'll be an inquiry into this. Stuart's inquiry into this one, I'd say. Reardon, Flynn, well done Flynn, old man Flynn, well done. Oh, brilliant. Flynn is doing well now. Oh, another penalty. Ref waves him on, oh, very hard done by there. <coughs> that was terrible. Flynn certainly knocked down there. That was a desperate move. Stephen Flynn. Very hard luck there now to get a penalty, Stephen Flynn. 
ref was very biased on that occasion. Now he takes a swipe at it out to Sheedy. The old fellas are coming into their own now. Ball he comes out here for Ella. Long one. Hit and hope. Fellas has it. Stephen. Stephen. Now we see. Oh, Quinny. No, no. Yes. Very easy there. That's it. Ronnie just got it by the fingernails. Out again to the middle. PJ Allen chins it, I think. And then over to the header, I think he chinned that ball. Corley comes out. Still met here now at the moment. Ball cleared now again. Justin, another straight pass, and Quinney sends one. Not in the direction of Cole Ray, in the direction of Shannon Airport, right, Anna. We'll take a while to retrieve a second ball here now, I think. I see Dinny Ryan with the Martin Grizzly Hogan Perpetual Trophy. Ready to present it to the winners. Substitution now, number 10. Replaces the local publican. Hasn't much wind, had a few late nights over the weekend, I suppose. A few words exchanged between Minnie uh, Slay and the local publican. Local publican not too pleased. Feels insulted at what Slay had to say to the manager. Slay said he didn't make much of an impression. The crowds are pouring into Shawlice Park at the moment. All here with their backs to the breeze, though, I must say, nobody down facing the wind. The pace of the game has dropped considerably here now. I know the stream sheet is leaving. Late, late night last night with, with Michael Lister, I suppose, in Montrose. And a few small ones before he left. Here's Matty Kendi. That's a great ball. Quinney goes in now. Yes, oh, rounds the keeper well. Oh, my goodness. Yes, just got it. Controversy here. Controversy here. Was it over the line? <coughs> <coughs> Was it over the line? The crowd are going out right here, going mad. Oh, they're looking for TV, TV review. We can't get it. Ronnie is smiling. He's hiding something. I said. Back here we go again now. Oh, a brilliant try there, by, by Robert, but just wide of the post. Mark kicks it out now. And to Kendi. Nightingale has it. Oh, that's a dangerous tackle. I have to say the referee is very lenient here now. Anthony Freeman again. Leahy playing the Stormers as a sweeper. Tahi. Well watered after half time. I'd say he has about two gallons of water drank since the game started, does he? And, to, and to Robert. Anthony again. Nice ball now. Justin has gone back to the back again now. Bit of a row going on here now, yes, bit of a row. That's a great ball in. And Maher nurses it wide of the post. 
I must say the intensity has dropped a bit here now. Oh, the goings on of the Patrick's weekend is taking his toll on most of the players. I have to say the freshest one out in the field at the moment is P.J. O'Donnell. Clean ball back in now again. I see Metro and Anthony Hogan here. Two brothers of the late and great Grizzly. Some people haven't realised that this is a no smoking field here. Still going strong at the fags. An <laughs> attack on here now, Quinn. Has the pace to beat Robert. Moroni advances. Oh! I wonder was that a penalty? No, the referee wears a man again. Oh, referee is <coughs> half asleep there, I think. Yellow card for descent here now. Yellow card for descent. The referee will be put on the first train back to Paris, I'd say. Robert. Matty. John Sheedy takes a mile swipe at it. Wonder he didn't get a hamstring there by doing that. Yes, race on here now. Moroni doing well. Moroni is doing well, I have to say. Nightingale goes up for it now. Stephen Flynn. No, there's definitely an attack on here. Two against one. Oh, what a pathetic effort. What a pathetic effort by Queenie. Well, will the spies be divided here today, I wonder? As Denny Ryan lights up again. The excitement is too much for him. Nightingale is doing well this time. Oh! Sharp power. Oh, referee is driving the crowd mad here now. He's smiling his way to, smiling away to himself. A wry old smile he has. <coughs> Stephen Flynn now. That's a great centre. Nobody there to collect it. Only Lahey. Nigel, Nigel is going to have a go here. Yes, he is. Anthony, Anthony. Nightingale, out here. A great flick. Back to Matty. Matty to Nigel. Nigel going through. Oh, well done, Nigel. Nigel playing his heart out here now, trying to get the winner. Yes. Yes, there's a goal coming here, I'd say. No, no, now he playing well again. Now he playing well again. Some of the players sweating up here now like bad horses. Anthony Freeman clears it out. Sheedy with a big wide swing at it. Attack now by Arla, broken up again. Stephen Flynn has it. Oh, brilliant! A brilliant pass by Stephen Flynn. And it, oh my goodness, offside. Offside. Nanny has the ball now. Nanny on to Dahi. But Scott is under, he blocks it. A deft touch to Anthony. Anthony on to Dahi. Dahi centers it. And into Mahal in his own. Oh, we have a change of goalie again. We have a change of goalie again. Yes. 
Frank Quinn going back into goals. Yes, Matty all the way now. Oh, very late whistle by the ref again there. A very late whistle by the ref. Now he's going up for this one, I see him threatening up. Wish she is there. Jer Power. This is Jer Power. My eyesight is going as well. <laughs> Stephen. There's a local publican again. Look at him. Denny Quinn, will he go score? No goal here. No, Maloney comes out, gathers. Maloney kicked that from outside the penalty area, but the ref didn't see it. I don't know why. Oh my goodness. I say the referee's body will be very annoyed at the performance of the French referee they're after bringing over for this match. It'll be much better if you get an Irish fella, I think. French fella's letting too much go. Standing in the middle of the field, admiring himself most of the day. Nanny plays with the ref, but to no avail. Flood and Lahey. Nigel right, playing brilliantly at the moment. Yes. Lahey is there again. Playing him. <laughs> Bit of a row going on here now. The public and the local musician are at odds with each other there now. I say Lahey's bookings are gone west after that tackle. Nanny, dancing around as Lahey clears out again. Nigel Flood and Anthony. Denny Quinn now gets it. The ball goes out over the line. Oh my goodness. That's a brilliant. By Justin, he, he rides down in agony. Justin badly injured, I'd say. No, he's up again. He's going to be all right. Time ticking away now. Oh, brilliant. Brilliant Stephen Flynn again now. Really having a good second half. Should have passed that ball in there to Ferris. Ferris waiting on his own foot. Maloney again now. But only thinks he's out in the costa, he's teeing it up in a divot. Kicks it out. Robert and Anthony. Nanny again. Nightingale, good man. PJ coming into his own again now after the breather. Sheedy's gone out of the game altogether. Here comes Stephen Flynn again. Goal coming up here, I swear, yes. Has to be. If they don't score this, oh my goodness. Straight into Maroney's hand. The pair holding up very well here now today. We, we, we consider the goal and go to Ferrum here today now for most of the horses out into the field. I have to say, Lahey doing his utmost. Free kick in now. Good ball up. Lahey goes up, clashes with one of his own men. Mayor comes out and handles the ball. 
Handlers the ball. Another penalty. Another penalty. Another penalty. That's not to say there was about six of them down at this end of the field that weren't given, but however, he gives this one. And he's looking around to see who's going to take it. We got Lehi has the confidence up. Lehi has the confidence up. And who's going to go? It's Quinny. Oh, brilliant. Brilliant. Keeper had no chance. Time taken away now here. Sure, nice park. I'd say we'll have to give the player of the match to the referee anyway. You could say he, he's after playing a blinder. He's half blind, I'd say. Kick off again now. Bit of a dispute. Back 10 yards, yes. Stephen Flynn, blocked by Lahey. Stephen again, good man Stephen. After beating three or four players, they are now back again. He's some soccer player, this fella. Pat Ryan is minding his shins at the moment. Game over. Matty Kendi. Hey, Pat! Oh, brilliant save by Maroney, absolutely brilliant. Diving to his left. The left blows up. Oh! They've been talking about this for years. The referee is going to get lost in the bushes. <coughs> There's a, a major run back now. Oh. Maher. Oh, oh, Paddy Maroney again. What a magnificent day Maroney is having. <laughs> Will he score this now? Oh, my goodness. <coughs> Ferris is a cute man now. He'll, he'll try and make Maroney go the wrong way. What did I say? Yes. Now we have the Mayo man, steeped in soccer tradition, this man. Will he drill it left or right? Ah! Well, if Mayo could do that, it'd win many in all Ireland. <laughs> Jared's taking a short run up to this one now. Oh, brilliant into the corner, yes. Will you take a long run up, I wonder? <laughs> oh, my goodness! Oh, my goodness! <laughs> oh, dear God. Now, well, that's it. Oh, a great bit of fun there. A great bit of fun. I'm sending him go on. Peggy White of the late Martin is going to present the Grizzly Hogan Perpetual Trophy now to Quinny. Uh, after a brilliant display, we won't say. But um, Peggy, would you like to say a few words maybe before I you? Indeed, Sean. Thanks very much. I want to say thanks to the winning team and to all the teams for turning out on a really blistery cold day. To all the spectators, to Robin for being here for the video, for yourself for doing the commentating, which will be shown at a later date. And to thank the spectators and all the kids, the committee, loads of sandwiches and hot beverages above in the Seamers pub later on. Don't forget. And this pack on behalf of the family to Queenie here for the Queenie and I'd also yeah. like <laughs> because Pat Hoare is brilliant he has organised this for up to five years now at this stage and I want to present him with a special little gift from my own family here it's a token 
I hope he likes it. A photograph that I've been scouring the parish for the last week and uh, for, of the team, for the Premiership team. Pat. Oh, okay. Yeah. I'd like to thank the garage and Jordan, especially in the garage, for helping me with this and to um, John Maher Frames, wow. Summerhill. Okay. What can I say? I'm blown away. That's um, stuff for words. I never think I've ever been stuff for words. But anyway, um, just want to thank everyone for coming. It's actually a great occasion. I look forward to doing it every year. And you can just see by the support that's here how much it means. You know, Grizz above there now looking down on top of us and he's laughing his arse off above now. He's <laughs> and laughing everyone, watching PJ making food himself from around the field again. <laughs> and, but lads, thanks for everyone for coming, Peggy. Family, thank you so much. That's that's way too much. That's unreal. That's unreal. But that's everyone come up to the seamers after a bit of refreshments and we we'll romance a few old videos and stuff like that. And um we'll have a few beers or whatever, okay. But thanks for coming. Thanks, guys. <laughs> That's it, so lads. Thanks everybody again. And the video will be available, as Peggy says, later. And the later, the better, I'd say. <laughs> okay.